All right, guys, here's how you add employees to your Clover devices. Again, just because we are on the Clover station, you can do this from all devices, Flex Mini included. So first off, you go to the employees app that has the three people as the icon. Go ahead and select that. You can see where we already have some employees listed here, but we're gonna make a new one. So first we're gonna select the green plus arrow on the bottom right. We're gonna put in the employee's name. So let's say it's me, AJ. My passcode will do 1133 and my role. So the role is really important because that's gonna give the, the employee access to the Clover and certain permissions. Meaning that the employee will be able to go into the register to make a sale add an order and close out an order, but it will not allow the employee to do refunds, voids, etc. Now, if you do want them to be able to do that, you would just go ahead and select employee, and then you can make them an admin or a manager that will give them some more access. We'll get into the access part of it in a second. So we're just gonna leave it as employee. Now we're gonna add the fingerprint as well. So they can either access the device with the four digit code or the fingerprint. I'm gonna go ahead and select the fingerprint. The scanner is right here, and you just go through the steps. All right guys, so we're still on the employees app. Like mentioned in the previous video, each employee will have certain permissions on what they can access in the Clover. So to, to determine that, you're gonna go over to permissions right here and select it. So now let's focus on AJ, right? So you can see AJ, everything that's checked off here, I have access to. So more tools, which is the app marketplace, the cash log to see all your cash transactions for the day, batching out, Clover Dining. But let's say you do not want AJ to have access to the app marketplace, you would just simply tap the checked box to uncheck the box. And you're gonna do that for each app that you have downloaded on your Clover. So you can literally determine whether or not an employee, a manager, admin, whatever, has access to whatever you really want them to have access to.